Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, and today I am going to be going to a bookstore. That, uh, you know, it's not at all scary. I mean, maybe for the average person, but yeah, that's not scary at all. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just going to be taking you guys to a bookstore. Yeah, it's pretty self-explanatory. I planned on shopping for my best friend's birthday present even though her birthday isn't for a while. So this video will be out before her birthday. So I really need to make sure I don't show the book I'm buying for her in the video. So yeah, this might be a little difficult because, I mean, I mean, come on. She watches every single one of my videos. Like she has her notification, she has the notifications bell on. I mean, I doubt anybody else has that on other than like, oh no, I think my brother does. And my mom might, I'm not sure. Um, but, other than that, I mean, those are the only people who have my notifications bell on. So it's going to be very hard to not show it in the video. Okay, it might be easy, but I'm going to... I'm just trying to make everything over dramatic like always, guys. Come on, you know me. I'm, I'm sitting finally... Uh, oh, man. Okay, so I was sitting with my bookshelves in the background, but I just realized that they are not in the full thing, so I need to fix that real quick. Wait. Oh, look at that. That's so beautiful. Oh, and the chair. <laughs> Oh, I really wish that blanket wasn't there. Wait, maybe I can just... Oh, oh no. Oh, I dropped something. <sighs> okay, I just chunked it on my bed. All right. So, I just had to fix that because my bookshelves, I'm sitting in front of my bookshelves by myself for the very first time and I thought it was amazing. <sighs> It's awesome. I love having my new bookshelves. They're so beautiful and they're just so nice to have in my room. I get to stare at them 24 hours a day now instead of half that time in my closet. So that's a, that's a bonus of having beautiful. <laughs> um, just kidding. Okay, so I know that she she likes books that I like. Like we have the same for, we have the same favorite author. But the problem is that she's, okay, there's no problem here. It's just I think she leans more towards romance and, like, contemporary novels. And I lean more towards fantasy and action and all that crap. So, I mean, this is, I'm reading this right now. So, I mean, come on. She's probably reading, I don't know what she's reading. She's reading, like, four books at once. Or, no, she's reading The Leaving. That's a contemporary novel. I mean, come on. I... I think I know what section to go in. Um, I'm gonna go into the contemporary section and uh, I was gonna say that if I like the look of the book, maybe she will too. Um, so I would go to the fantasy section, but that's me, not her. And I know, like, she loves contemporary novels. I mean, she's, she just loves, like, romance and comedy and stuff like that. And I just thought maybe I would get her a contemporary novel. Okay, um, you guys know that I am into fantasy, like I just said. Um, literally almost every book on the shelves behind me is like high fantasy. Except for like, let's see, like one, two, and there's a few retellings. So yeah, I have like five um, contemporary novels. I know what I'm looking for. I just feel like maybe I'll find one that I think is cool or, oh, I was gonna say a book that I could get her, but she's gonna watch this. So I can't say that. This is gonna be fun though. I'm really excited. And this is, I just realized, a very, very long intro. I'm gonna have to cut a lot of this down. So, uh. Oh, also, I love this outfit. And I didn't know if you guys noticed it or anything. I just think it's adorable. I just wanted to show it off. The Captain America shirt. Captain America. I think my favorite Marvel superhero is. You know what? I'm not gonna name favorites. Yeah, I'm not gonna name favorites. Yeah. I have detoured very much, so I'm going to go ahead and start the video. Hey everybody, I'm in the car, going to the store, and uh, this is what my mom listens to all the time in the car. She also watches it at home on Netflix. It's called Forensic Files. Hey guys, so we are at a bookstore, and it's going to be really awkward in there because I've actually never done this in public, so we'll see what happens what the entrance of any bookstore should look like. Just saying. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, guys, this is 3.97. Okay, I knew this section was here. I just want to act like it's crazy that it's here. Oh my gosh, 3.97. I want to be a little inconspicuous, but look.
she loved this one. Um, I want a book kind of like this. And there's some books here. I'm not sure what some of these are though. Later, Gator. <laughs> um, that just, it's so out of place on the shelf because they're all like. <sighs> and her dad's waiting to miss Rothschild. Choose the front. And she'll be off to college with Peter. That's cool. Always and forever. Oh, I think I've seen, I think that's, is that? Lara Jean. Oh, the conclusion to the all the boys I've, I've loved before. Oh, it is? Yeah. Cool. I knew that was, was that. Do you have this one? Triple? Books. Okay. I'm not showing hers. Hers is at the bottom. You'll never guess what it is. Just try to guess. You won't. And the top two are mine. I'm not showing you what they are until I get home. Right next at the, at the checkout. Oh, yeah. All right, so we just got out of the bookstore, and... It was, it felt so good in here, in there, and then we walked out here, it was so hot. And I drank an entire bottle of water in there, so my stomach is like hurting. It's 105. 105 degrees. <sighs> That's too hot. There should be a law against how hot the sun can get. <laughs> I need to talk to God about that. <laughs> yeah. Books, as you can see. And I'm not showing hers yet, but I'll show you mine when I get home. And we got a planner for school this year because you're taking a bunch of hard classes. Yep. And it's scary, but I can do it. And this is cool. This is really cool. It has a bunch of... Oh, oh that's right. Hopefully that helped. It has a bunch of... Um, it has, obviously, normal planner stuff. I like how it's like bigger so I can write a bunch of things on it. They just kept walking. They just, yeah. What the heck? Also, in the back there's like stickers and stuff. Practice, practice, volunteer activity. Does it have test ones? Probably, yeah. Come on, there needs to be a test one. I don't think there's one for tests. Wait, is there more? There's more, but they have one for dentists. They don't have one for tests? Put it under cow, what's cow? Cow. Oh, cow. <laughs> so my mom's voice got in the video and she goes, can you please crop that out? Hey everybody, so I am back from the bookstore. I am home. We did a lot today. We went to, I took the ACT this morning. Then I came home and just chilled, um, chilled with my mom for a little bit. We went to Kohl's um, and she shopped there. We went to a bookstore. So, you know, I guess she likes clothes. I like books, whatever. She was going to get one for herself and I wanted her to, but she didn't, so... Sadly, we also went to Walmart at the end for the food for the groceries, um, obviously. What else? Um, so I'm just going to show you what I got at the store. So the first one I'm going to show you is a cover. I'm not going to show you the the actual like name of the book or anything, but this is the book that I bought for my friend Emmy. So I'm just going to show you what the hardcover looks like, how long it is. And I'm going to make sure not to show the spine because it says the name on it. But I think she's going to love this book. I'm not really going to tell you anything about it, obviously, but show you the orange cover. If you can, don't, like, don't guess below what it is, if you know, because I don't want her to see the comments and, and like, get an idea of what it is, because I don't want her to be surprised for her birthday. So the um, first book for me that I bought at the bookstore was In Game 1, The Calling by James Frey and Nils Johnson Shelton. But this is the new book that I bought. It's, uh, I bought lengthy books, um, which is fine with me. This looked really interesting. I looked in the, on the inside and I flipped through some pages and it, it, it the writing style is kind of cool, I think. And I'm really excited for this book. Uh, I don't know a lot about it, only that I think they're trying to save the human race or something or save Earth or something. And it's, it's called Endgame because it's like the end of the world or something. And I'm not too sure, so don't take my word for it because I haven't read it. Um, I haven't even read the blurb on the inside cover. Um, because I don't want to ruin anything because I like reading them without knowing what it's about. Next, the, the I only got two books for me. Um, the second one for me is Renegades by Marissa Meyer. Now, I've never read the... Okay. Lunar Chronicles, that's what they're called. The first one is Cinder. The Lunar Chronicles, I've never read those, but um, I got this because it looked really cool, and if I like this, I'll probably get into 
the Lunar Chronicles as well, which I'm really excited for because this one looks so good. And I know it's, I only thing I know is that it's an anti-hero story. So it follows the villain instead of the hero. Like obviously the villain thinks that the heroes are villains and that they're heroes. So unless I'm just totally getting that wrong, they dress in black and stuff like that. And here is just in colorful stuff. So I don't know, maybe they know the villains. You know, some, some villains aren't all bad, you know, like some, like I doubt she's like, she's probably the villain. I'm pretty sure. And I, I doubt she's all bad. I think I'm gonna read this next because this looks awesome. And I know I have a ton of books back there that I told you guys I would read. And you probably see them on the shelves and you're just like, oh, get to that book. And I'm just like, sorry, but I really wanna read this. And it's really long, but like, I feel like it'll be good. I'm really excited Look, because I love books that like have a good color and a good front and a good name. And like the back makes it sound so cool. And, and is lengthy and I'm glad because I love long books because if it's good you don't want it to end and I'm glad that I got it. Also, $5.97 and $3.97. Oh, these are gonna be so hard to hold. Endgame and Renegades. I'm so excited for these two books. I haven't been ex this excited for any book in so long so I'm, I'm so, I am overjoyed this is going to be awesome i'm going to have a reading weekend or whatever i don't know you'll see this book in my next reading vlog for sure ah oh i'm really glad that that didn't fall all uh, last thing i want to show you is my school um calendar thing it's uh 2019 uh, august 2018 to december 2019 it's very pretty on the front and uh it has a, a bookmark so I can know my place and I already showed you the inside and stuff so I don't need to do that again but here is my calendar thing I know I agenda that's what it is agenda slash calendar so stoked and it took it was so short that was the shortest book trip I have ever taken I'm not being like I'm being serious these books have been like like, okay, no, neither one of these books are on my Goodreads want to read or on my list. Well, they are now. I just put them there um, after I got them. But, I mean, come on. You have so many books on your list. And then when you get to the, the bookstore, you don't, you just, like, you can't find the exact books on your list all the time. And, and then you see something else and you just have to have it. So, I had to have, had to have, I had to have both of these books. I'm going to read these books very soon. I might just have a reading party tonight. Also remember to like, subscribe, and comment down below for new content so you never miss a video and hit those notification bells. So I'm going to see you guys later. I really hope you enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it. Um, so other than that, that's pretty much it.